five. The Cleveland Courage Fund has topped $750,000. And Amanda, Gina, and Michelle could have more money coming their way and a free ride of college if a Cleveland lawmaker has his way. State Representative John Barnes Jr. introduced a bill in Columbus today that would provide Amanda, Gina, and Michelle with at least $25,000 for each year they spent in captivity and free health care for life. This is not a giveaway, but it seeks to restore what they would have had uh, had they been free. Had they been free, the women would have had a chance to attend college. Now they have that opportunity. The bill also gives free tuition to any state university or college. Given the fact that uh, during their high school years, most of them were, um, were held, and so we want to give them an opportunity um, to go to state institutions without uh, pay or cost. If the legislation passes, the act would cover any victim held in captivity for eight years or longer. Uh, this is an unusual situation. It's one that the state does have some responsibility um, to be involved in and to try to help, um, help these uh, young ladies back.